with her fans. Britney Spears sporting a newly shaved head and small neck tattoo shows up at Body and Soul Tattoo Parlor in Sherman Oaks to get more body art. The paparazzi and public wait outside for a glimpse of the pop princess's new look. Did she know what she wanted? Yeah, she just wanted something real small on her wrist, something dainty. What did she decide on? Um, she got some cute little uh, lips on her wrist. Red lips? Red lips with a little pink. How long did that take? About half an hour. Spears stepping out tonight after reportedly entering a rehab facility in Antigua on Wednesday and checking out just one day later. Tonight, LAPD officers conduct crowd control outside the tattoo shop and clear the way for Spears to get into her waiting SUV. But bald Brittany tries to hide her new look with a hooded sweatshirt. Fans didn't seem to be impressed with her latest image. We could see it in the one mirror, and her hair is completely shaved. Like... It looks terrible. Completely bald. She had no hair left on her head. And what do you think about this? She looks like she's having an issue right now. The staff at Body and Soul say Spears showed up without any notice, and the large crowd with cameras outside forced them to close their doors to the public while the pop star was there. It was definitely different. That's you know, this doesn't happen every day. You don't have you know, 60 people standing outside and cops coming and stuff like that. Yeah. Okay, so once again, Max Scott, the tattoo artist here at Body and Soul in Sherman Oaks, telling me that Brittany came in tonight and got a tattoo, a pair of lips on her wrist, uh, something like this. All right, that's actually lipstick. It's not, uh, it's not tattoo ink, but just to give you an idea of what it looked like. He showed me a sketch earlier. Now, coming up a little bit later in the newscast, I talked to somebody who was inside when Brittany was getting her tattoo and asked her, Brittany, why did you shave her head? We'll tell you what Brittany told her. That's coming up a little later in the newscast. Reporting live in Sherman Oaks, Leslie Miller, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Mark and Michelle, back to you. Leslie, thank you.